Alice's Adventures in Wonderland, written by Lewis Carroll and first published in 1865, is a seminal work of children's literature and a remarkable example of literary nonsense. Its enduring appeal lies in its imaginative narrative, playful language, and intricate symbolism. The book's impact stretches far beyond its initial reception, influencing countless adaptations, interpretations, and creative works across various media. To understand why Alice's Adventures in Wonderland has captivated readers for over a century, it's crucial to delve into its narrative structure, themes, and the broader cultural context in which it was created. Narrative Structure The story begins with a simple premise. Alice, a young girl, falls down a rabbit hole and finds herself in a fantastical world, filled with peculiar creatures and bizarre logic. Unlike traditional fairy tales with clear moral lessons or linear plots, Carol's narrative is characterized by its episodic structure. Each chapter introduces new characters and scenarios that challenge Alice's understanding of reality, contributing to the book's whimsical and surreal quality. The episodic nature of the narrative allows Carol to explore a variety of themes and concepts, from identity and growth to the absurdities of social conventions. The transitions between episodes are often abrupt and nonsensical, reflecting the chaotic and unpredictable nature of the Wonderland universe. This structure mirrors the experiences of children as they navigate a world that often seems arbitrary and confusing. Themes and Symbolism One of the most prominent themes in Alice's Adventures in Wonderland is the exploration of identity and self-discovery. Alice's frequent physical transformations, such as shrinking and Growing, symbolize the fluid nature of identity during childhood. Her encounters with characters like the Cheshire Cat and the Mad Hatter further challenge her, and the reader's sense of self and reality. The Cheshire Cat's ability to appear and disappear at will, for example, underscores the idea that identity is not fixed but can be elusive and multifaceted. The book also serves as a satirical commentary on Victorian society and its rigid social norms. Characters such as the Queen of Hearts, who arbitrarily decrees, off with their heads, represent the absurdity of authoritarian power and the arbitrary nature of societal rules. Similarly, the Mad Hatter's nonsensical tea party reflects the chaotic and often illogical nature of social conventions and etiquette. Through these, Characters, Carol critiques the absurdities of his contemporary society, making the book not only a whimsical tale but also a sharp social commentary. Another key theme is the critique of logic and reason. Carol, whose real name was Charles Lutwidge Dodgson, was a logician and mathematician, and his background is evident in the book's playful manipulation of logic and language. The dialogue in Wonderland often subverts traditional logical reasoning, as seen in the nonsensical riddles and paradoxes. This playful use of logic challenges readers to think differently about the nature of reasoning and the arbitrary nature of societal norms. Literary style and language. Carol's use of language is a defining feature of Alice's adventures in Wonderland. The book is filled with puns wordplay, and nonsensical poetry that delight readers of all ages. The dialogue between characters is often absurd and playful, reflecting the whimsical nature of Wonderland itself. For example, the famous line, We're all mad here, captures the essence of the book's tone and highlights its embrace of the absurd. The linguistic creativity in the book is not merely for entertainment, it also serves as a tool for exploring deeper philosophical questions. Through its playful manipulation of language, the book invites readers to question the meaning and limits of communication. This approach encourages readers to engage with the text on a more intellectual level, appreciating the layers of meaning behind the surface-level whimsy. Cultural impact. Since its publication, Alice's
Adventures in Wonderland has had a profound impact on literature, art, and popular culture. The book has inspired numerous adaptations, from films and television shows to stage productions and video games. Its characters and motifs have become iconic symbols, representing a wide range of interpretations and cultural references. The story's influence extends beyond entertainment, it has also had a significant impact on psychology and philosophy. The concept of the wonderland as a metaphor for the human psyche has been explored by various scholars, who use the book's themes to analyze the nature of consciousness and identity. Additionally, the book's nonsensical elements have made it a subject of interest in discussions about the nature of reality and the limitations of human understanding. Conclusion Alice's Adventures in Wonderland is a multifaceted work that continues to captivate and intrigue readers through its imaginative narrative, playful language, and rich thematic content. Its episodic structure allows for a wide exploration of ideas and concepts, from the fluidity of identity to the absurdities of societal norms. Carroll's inventive use of language and his critique of logic and reason add depth to the story making it both entertaining and thought-provoking. The book's impact on literature, art, and popular culture underscores its enduring relevance and universal appeal. As both a whimsical adventure and a profound commentary on human nature, Alice's Adventures in Wonderland remains a timeless classic, inviting readers of all ages to explore the boundaries of imagination and the complexities of the human experience.